appreciate you guys. Uh, welcome back to another video. Today, guys, uh, be doing a knife review. Um, it's a Case Ridgeback Hunter. Um, it's a pretty nice knife. Um, uh, it'll be uh, uh, an unboxing video. Uh, just picked this thing up. Uh, pretty nice. It's, uh, I picked this thing up for around eighty nine dollars. The internet price for a case was 110. Picked this thing up at uh, Smoky Mountain Knife Works a little bit back. Um, pretty nice, comes in a nice box. Uh, comes in a nice plastic bag. It's all back together. Has uh, the not real nice rosewood handles. Um, some of the ones that you can find online, it's got um, plastic handles. Um, to me, I'd rather have a wood handle knife. Uh, just holds up better. Um, plus, if you need to, you can refinish this. Yes. Um, if you really need to, um, there's probably no surprise that uh, cases last a long time. Um, it does have a an inner sheath with this leather sheath uh, makes it a pretty nice little extra um, blade length from here to you know the tip is uh, 4.1 inches the overall is eight and a half um, weight of this knife comes in at 4.2 ounces Yeah, I think a plastic knife is probably a little less than a weight part of it just because it's it's uh, plastic and not the, the wood handle. Um, yeah, that makes a pretty big difference for maybe some people that carry a knife every day. Um, this here will probably be a uh, not an everyday carry but a, a hunting knife per se. Um, has a real nice curved blade to it um, allows you to work with uh, multiple edges instead of you know just one edge um, they give you a real nice serration right here and on that tip you know that's uh, that helps with uh, maybe your movement or it keeps you from slipping or if you do kind of get a little bit dirty taking care of your harvested animal um, the leather case is a very very good plus um, usually leather lasts a long time uh, it kind of weathers itself in uh, with a plastic case you kind of uh, get the same thing every time you know it, it, it doesn't defy how much you use the knife but I find that the leather sheath maintains the, the age really well um, a good friend of mine had one of these and well it's something similar to this and uh, i've been looking for one for a long time i finally found one and uh, i care for it very much uh, it's a uh, pretty nice and upholstered and it has uh rivets to it the bolstering comes through the the back side of it uh, pretty far um, that's just to help ensure that it stays together for a long time um, they've also riveted this back piece of leather here so they've they've cut it out all in one piece uh, it's not pieced together it's sewn together um, these are riveted together uh, just an overall very nice knife um, we'll get you in and uh, Take a closer look at this guy. All right, guys, here's a little closer look at this. Uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, rosewood handles give it a real nice extra. Uh, 
they give you a real nice big hole if you like to put your uh, lanyards in there and uh, things like that I know some people like that uh, I technically do not um, I guess it just depends on each individual person It's a pretty nice case, double X. Of course, always USA. This is a pretty nice knife, and the case is, uh, is as well as very nice. See, this is where this case is. Is, uh, all one piece is pretty nice this way um, a whole lot less parts to fail that way All right here's uh, that plastic inner sheath that I was talking about makes it a pretty nice well-rounded knife it is all in one package it makes it pretty nice Let's turn this.